Is Maria doing here? I got to call my girl. Somebody fast before all that dries up. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> the only thing that's going to dry up is that tie weave of yours. Oh, no, 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 boo -boo. This is all natural, okay? Mm -hmm. Emphasis on the L. Okay. Okay. Girl, who is that? What? Over there. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. 
answer the door. That's so ghetto. No, I'm so real. Anyway, so what's up? Oh, oh no. Listen, I just got paid. I ain't even paid my bills yet, okay? Can I do me first? Raylan, hush. Ain't nobody come over here and borrow no money from you. Okay, go sit down then. But I did come over there to tell something really serious. What? Serious? You're not dying, are you? Listen, I done told you by chasing all those pretty faces, I told you you gonna catch up with you one of these days. Listen, do you have insurance because... Woman, woman, can you please be quiet? Look, I've been seeing this woman named Maria. I really like her. Mm -hmm. She's pregnant. Wait, hold up. But it ain't mine. But I'm sure I can take care of both of them. Okay. My father left and ran out. And all I'm trying to do is just show her how a man can really treat a nice woman. Wow. That's deep. So when did you become this savior? <laughs> Not no savior. <laughs> I'm more like a lover. <laughs> okay, Mr. Lover Lover. Listen, if you feel this strongly, then give it a try. But if you give it a try, you better go all in. Don't be like these other guys out here playing the field, being selfish and whatnot. Okay? Most definitely. Okay. You know what? I can talk to you about anything. Yeah. We're yeah. friends for life. Yeah, we're friends, but you need to pay me. What? Yeah, what? I take EBT. Cabbage and rice and that. <laughs> you know what? You're crazy. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yeah. All right. All right. You take care. All right. You too, All right. Hey, baby girl. Hey, daddy. I don't feel good. I'm having some pains. <sighs> Go lay down. A matter of fact, I'll be there as soon as I can. I just left the office. I wish mom was still here. Okay. <sighs> okay. Oh. Charles came by talking about this woman he met that's pregnant. The child's not his, thank God. But he's really into her, so I told him he should give it a shot. Yeah? Yeah. You ready? You gonna meet her? Well, yeah, I think he'll set that up. You should meet him before you come and give her a shot. Well, he seemed like he's really into her and he really knows her, and so, I mean, it won't hurt, you know, to get to know her first, of course. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know, I already have my seed, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but anyway, you ready? Yeah. So what are we gonna do? I'm gonna go home and cook. Cook? Some collard greens. Collard greens?
there. Oh, shoot. Well, well, well. I say we meet again. Yes, I see. Go ahead. So what's up with you? What about that picnic? <laughs> So let me know one reason why I should let you take me on a picnic. Woman, ain't nobody can fix a turkey and cheese sandwich like I can, woman. <laughs> You're funny. I like that. Well, you're going to like me even more. You know why? Why? I don't have no kids. I've never been married. Baby, I'm single. You know what that means, don't you? And the Bible says, a man that finds a wife, finds a good thing obtained from the Lord. And for that, hmm. I want my good thing. So with that being said, I don't see no ring on your finger. We got to change that. And by the way, that's Proverbs 18.22, if you want to check. Yes, the word. <laughs> we need to slow down now. We got to get to know each other first. And... Once I make that commitment, it's a one-time deal, honey. One time. That's why you should take me up on my offer. On that day off time of that picnic. Look at you. Will you go on a date with me this <laughs> evening? I was about to say. <laughs> What's your name? How about that? My name's Stacy. Around here they call me Brandon, AKA God's Child. Okay. Little man of the Lord. Yes, ma'am. I need that in my life. Yes, you do. You know what? Let's change the All right, let's do it. I'll give it a try. This is the wrong number. I know you're everything code. I gotta find a pen. You know what? Lord, I may be crazy. I may be silly, but I thank you for being there for me when I needed you the most. I've come a long way. Where my money at? What do you mean, yo? I ain't got your money. Am I being filmed? Am I being punked? I want my money. Don't play dumb with me. I want my money and I want it now. If I have to tell you this one more time, they're gonna have to identify you by your teeth. If you still have any. Yo, Todd, please. It wasn't my call. Boo had it and he never gave it to me. Jesus, please. It's too late for Jesus. I ain't no Jesus. 
I'm your Jesus. First time I lay eyes on you, it was like a still voice in my head saying, "Go and snatch that woman up." <laughs> you know. Brandon, the past few months I've been the happiest I've ever been. Thank you. Right, you know what, though? I'm doing this right. <sighs> Hey, how are you? Hey, how I'm Miss Jackson doing? from the uh, adoption agency. Yeah, yeah. Come on in. Come on. How you doing? I'm good. That's good. That's good. I'm glad you made it today too. You have a beautiful home. Thank you so much. You could come on and sit down here. Okay, so we were able to find a nice, suitable family that really, really wants a little boy. The only thing we have left now is for you to sign. You just get out the top part and... <laughs> Listen, this is very important. You have to think about the well-being of the child. And this couple, they have what it takes to be able to take care of him and give him a better life. You have to think about what's best for that. Now, if you don't do this now, we may not be able to come across a couple that's this sufficient to be able to take care of him. God. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know where his father is. And my dad... He's so mad with me. So mad. I know that this is the best decision. It is. Really? I know this is the best decision. But I don't want him to be my father's responsibility. This is the best thing you can do for him. It's the right thing to do. Priya.
I do wrong? What did I do wrong? <sighs> Faith, get ready. I don't know where your Uncle Brandon is. We gotta get going. Okay, Auntie. Where's Brandon? He's supposed to take you home today. Sorry, I'll take you home. I don't mind. I have fun. Can we do this again sometime? But can we get extra pepperoni on the pizza? <laughs> sure you can. Of course. You get extra pepperoni. They were kind of stingy on it, weren't they? Yes, they did. Mm. All right, baby. Let's go. Yeah. All right, thank you for watching her for us. For babysitting, we appreciate it. Thank you. No problem. I love watching Faith. We have to do it again soon. Cool, more pepperoni? <laughs> yes, more pepperoni. All right. Okay. Bye. Brandon. Okay, that must be him right there. So when we finish with this deal, you're going to be so proud of me. I'm proud of you already because you helped this company become what it is today. Without your help, None of this was possible. So for that, I no. We thank you. Oh Lord, look at the time. We've been on this file way too long. What's wrong? I gotta take my baby Faith home. My wife been keeping her. You know, babysitting. Yeah, I understand. I understand. Well, I guess I'll see you back to the office on Monday. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Hey man, what's up? Hello? What? Accident? What happened? Damn! Everybody. I'm Sheree Vaughn. I am the writer, producer, director for the web series You Stand, We Stand Together. I hope you guys enjoyed episode one and I truly hope you guys enjoyed episode two. Episode three will be coming and it will get more juicy for you with a twist. <laughs> so make sure you stay tuned and share the video amongst all your family and friends. We want to push it out there as much as possible. 
the cast is really great. I appreciate them for seeing the vision in me. And stay tuned for more. God bless.